Chapter 4, that's where we are, 1 Corinthians. It, it's a very personal, difficult situation for the Apostle Paul. The people of the congregation, those in Corinth, well, they, they look down on Paul, that he's not an original apostle and questioned his authority. So Paul's dealing with people who were proud, judgmental, and in need of correction. So he had the difficult task of how to confront this obvious sin without being, well, too harsh or implying that he himself is above sin. How to get people to conform their lives to the gospel when they think too highly of themselves. The, the word is used puffed up. So Paul knows he must trust in the Lord's spirit and the truth of God's word to work in their lives. He reminds them in verse one that we're stewards and servants of the mysteries of God and we're required to be found, well, faithful. Stewards of all that we have and all that we have been given and to take this and be faithful with it, to serve others as Jesus served us and not be so proud. Servants, we're called to serve, not be proud and overbearing and to be faithful with the truth that God has, well, given to us by his spirit and through his word. So listen to what it says. It says here in chapter four, let a man so consider us, speaking about Paul and other apostles, as servants of Christ and stewards of the mysteries of God. And it's required of a steward that one be found faithful. As Paul deals with their pride and they're questioning his authority, he says, hey, basically we're all servants and we're all just stewards over what God has given us. And he says, and with that, be found faithful. Faithful.